Hello and welcome to SAS News Digest. Today we're going to start off with a thought-provoking op and a news clip from The Hill. Author Fei Fei Li took a look at the President Biden's National AI Research Resource Task Force, and the group is meant to help strengthen America's foundation on AI. Li, of all people, is a good person to ask about evolution of artificial intelligence today. After all, she's on the task force, and Fei Fei is very aware of the double-edged sword that AI can pose. Well, on one hand, it can be an amazing tool for improving prosperity and making jobs. On another, AI can turn into the oppressive and downright terrible force in our lives. And it's all about how we use it. And that is why it's clear that we have to build AI guidelines in accordance to the human rights concerns. Unfortunately, it seems like the task force is not well equipped for this issue. In order to make good AI policy, members of the force need to have the latest R&D available to them, and they have to see what's really going on in both the private and public sector. And groups that make policy on AI don't quite have that yet, which means they need to be transparent. And moreover, we need to make the point of getting innovative with our tech. Innovation is currently has a major pipeline in America. And our study started with federally funded universities and ended up in actually large corporations. So, what's the solution in mind? The tax force first shot at increasing transparency in bolstering innovation comes through a national research cloud. This would give people the chance to pull up the research from all kinds of different uh, facilities to bolster innovation and knowledge. This would help pivot innovation away from current model that basically places commerce at the helm of innovation and bring power back to the people. Hearing this made all us smile and think about how many strides could come from the new discoveries in AI and what that means to all of us. It is a patriotic move that's worth a 4th of July style celebration, and if you ask me. Next, let's turn our attention to fraud. Have you ever found yourself victimized by fraudsters? Or maybe a hacker who hit your bank account? Well, you're not alone. It's basically part of our modern life. Companies have been struggling to improve fraud protection for years, and now AI is coming into play. A startup by the name of Ensure AI is looking to change how fraud protection works. Rather than look at typical factors for fraudulent purchases, Ensure AI wants to use deep learning to help better detect fraudulent purchases, which means that transactions will be far less likely to be false flag for the fraud. Only 80% of high-risk transactions get approved by traditional means. And with Ensure AI Tech, that percentage bumps up to 98%. The Tel Aviv-based startup was able to raise $6.8 million in its most recent funding round. And honestly, we think this, this startup is poised for the success. After all, Two founders were first introduced to struggles that come with fraud from a gift card businesses they run. And when they first started out, around 40% of their transactions were fraudulent. To combat this, they developed their own platform to make transactions more secure. And that's a smash hit. They have already approved around 1 billion of sales since their launch in 2019. And needless to say, it seems like their clients definitely approve the tech they use. My name is Artem Gassan, and I help founders reach $5 to $10 million AR by combining the power of thought leadership, personalization at scale, and video content like this. To learn more about this amazing technology and my innovative approach to grow revenue, reach out to me on LinkedIn.